Tally ho there chaps, Archdungeon Gaming here, and today I'm bringing you a game in my Panzer 3 slash 4, because I can't decide on their numbers. We're playing on Arlenberg, and for once, I'm top tier. It's an encounter battle, I believe, yes it is. So, alright, so, so I could sit, like, in the river and just cap the base, haha, <laughs> that's funny. Alright, so I, I really like this tank at the moment. It's just completely stock. But it's it's a good tank, even when it's stock. You just have to be able to play it right. It's a medium tank. It's tier 5. Um, now, what this tank, like lots of other panzers, is for is just sneaking up and being like, oh, hold on, hold on. Probably someone else on coming on the side of the map. So I'm gonna let's go and find some cover. I think this is one of the more pretty Panzers. That's just my opinion. Uh, yes, I still have a cold. Oh, I saw a red base capture. I Means someone's at the base. There's an M7. Now, let's just pop in and find out. <laughs> I don't... There's an M5 Stewart that... Ah, oh, it's that bloody M7! I should have killed you. I don't want to get hit by the T28. T28 is strong gun. Made in Soviet Russia. Probably just narrowly avoided being hit there. This gun has a very long aiming time. And then at that, it only does about 90 oh, to 100 damage. It is the stock gun, so that's why. I'm trying to get a shot on that T28. Don't have a shot on him. So as long as we stay in here, they can't cap. Better get into the cover of this house. Let's pop out at the T28. Hey, just one shot that guy. I gotta go out the other way, are ya? Ah, oh, just... Alright, this gun has such a long reload. Well, it's not the longest I've seen. But it's one of them. Oh, now it's just me in here. I wanna... I, I wanna get that T-28. Oh, dang, come on out. Come on out, little guy. Nothing to be afraid of. Just me. M7 is just blasting away. He's gonna hit me sooner or later. I know that T28's there. I want to move, but then there's the M7. It's just got me pinned down. There's. angle a bit. <laughs> this is a very, very safe corner. Why is there artillery here? Don't want to let him hit me. Come on, M7. Nothing to be afraid of. I ah, better pull back in. Alright, so I've damaged most of their team. 
Alright, there we go. He's dead. Uh, move across the bridge. Dun, 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 dun. Now this tank has very good armor. That T-28 is dead. Ah, there's an M3 Lee. Nice of you to join us. Now, there's artillery. SC-76 is dead. Run away. Oh, there's a Grant. Hello, Granty. Uh... Alright, so that was that. That was the Panzer 3 slash 4, which is an amazing tank, and it's now one of my favorite tanks. And that was probably the best bet, one of the best battles I've had in it uh, today, because I just got it today. Um, so you can see, I've also been working, I've been grinding my way up to the KV-1, which is still 1,143 away. So we're going to go and play the T-28. Which is a Russian tier 4 medium. Um, which is quite good. And I wish there was another medium that came after it. That was like the KV-1. But more like the Z-28. Uh, KV-1 by no means is a slow tank. Um, it can go 40 kilometers an hour with the upgraded engine. Which is faster than some light tanks. Such as the AMX-40. Um, T-14 premium. And also, um, in one or two updates, they're taking out the T14, which you can still buy, um, then be able to have it. Um, I think there's like a Asian tank there. It's very long. No, there's a Tog too. So you're gonna want to buy that while you still can. And um, for a little limited time in the store, you can buy the Panzer II J. Um. Which is a, I think it's tier 2 or tier 3 premium German light tank, which is pretty much impregnable to things of its tier. Even though this T28 could easily like, one shot it. Now, the T28 with its upgraded gun is, um, its, it's gun is very powerful. Uh, Panzer 1C. Der ging nicht durch. It's German. Now its autoloader can do quite a bit of damage to me. I don't know what's hitting me. So I'm going to pound to the cover of this house. Run away. I don't know what's hitting me, so uh, it's probably that VK. 30.01. Oh, dang it. Tree fell. Nope. Ah, nope. No, 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 no. What is... <sighs> These houses are very safe now. What is shooting me? I don't see it. I want to kill it. I'm only on 48 health, mind you. Oh, is it that bloody tank destroyer on the bridge? Which I can't see. But I don't need to see it to kill it. So let's get the heck out of Dodge, because 48 health. I have a great gun. But I can't really do much. We're losing by four, by three. Sorry. <laughs> now that T14 is getting a bit too close for comfort, and that Matilda, I'm not sure if even this gun will penetrate it. So, um, defend the base. 
I just need to pop over and spot that T14. Oh my god, I'm dead. Shunt a shot. Oh, oh, oh. I am so lucky that that didn't hit me. Let's just pop back up. What the heck is the thing? No, we tilled it, we tilled it, we tilled it. Go, go away. Matil I, I, I linked my Matilda. It's just I don't like when other people drive them. Oh, hello. T14. Second thought. Let's scram. Hello. How is he not hitting me? I think he just is probably a bad player that just bought that tank. Nope. There we go. Alright, let's the T28. Uh, let's see if I can play another game in the Panzer 3-4. Ooh. What is this? Oh. Set an enemy vehicle on fire. Okay, so I'd have to hit their, hit their engine. Right, El Haluf. This is one of the best maps for playing this tank um, because it has an excellent um, off to the side. See that turret and that gun with that gun mantlet. If you're off to the side, it just goes whoop, 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 whoop. Um, that that looks like a really hot artillery. Well then, that's a tier seven game. It's KV3. And it's a very tier 7 game. There's more than three on our team and three on their team. <laughs> Luckily, there's. Oh, they have an FV304. We've already lost. That is the mighty Birthday Avenger, which is why I'm playing. Through the, I'm playing up to the cruisers, then into the Valentine to get the bishop, I believe. And then the FV 304. Because it can go s about 60 or 70 kilometers an hour. And it has like about 40 or 50 millimeters of armor. So it's good. So our entire team is just going up here, including me. And uh, just say in the comments if you agree that this is a very pretty tank. We have like an entire task force up here. I'm going to take a right up here. And there's a comet with 1,050 health. Well, less than 1,000, T29. Uh, no, don't die, mouse. Oh, God. Probably just my sticky mouse pad. I can kill it, I can kill it, I can kill it, I can kill it. I can kill it, I want to kill it, I want to kill it, I want to kill it. No, I can't kill it. You're going to kill it. Well, <laughs> already got it. Still haven't lost any health. Not much I can do in a tier 7 game. I'm only tier 5. I can do something in a tier 6 game quite well. Because this gun has quite a bit of penetration, but I won't be able to penetrate that T29. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Didn't mean to hit him. It Uh, oh, goodbye, Hellcat. <laughs> Run away. I will go protect Artie. I'm not coward. I'm, I'm strate strategically retreating. Strategic retreat. Um, yes, I do understand. It's been um five or six days since I've done a video. 
but through that time you guys supported that video, the tribute to the TOG, um, it's because I've been doing a lot, there were death threats at my school, so that wasn't good, so I, um, was doing, I had to do stuff at school, uh, there's SBAC testing, which is a computerized test, um, which I'm not sure if I'm allowed to actually say anything about, um, but, yeah. Just do a bit more damage to it, and I will pop in. <laughs> Hello, chum. There you go. I, I can do damage to uh, Cromwells. Cromwells are very fast tanks. They can pretty much rival the ELC AMX in speed. And speaking of that, I, I, I'm working on getting. Oh god. Uh. No, type 34. Right. So we're like putting up about a half hour video just to uh, keep you guys happy. This is the tank you have to play through to get to the beautiful ELCA Hibax. I just play it on the side. Um, so then I'm playing the Cruiser Mark II to get here to the Valentine. And then, yes, you go to the Bishop. And I'm actually going to get the Archer as well, because I want those. So you start off here with a 135 fire engine, and then get up to 165, which is not a lot. And then, see, here's the FE-304, Birth the Avenger. Um, but also, just playing the M3 Stewart for a bit of fun, to get to the M5 Stewart. Because that leads up to the Chaffee, and yeah. But let's just work on getting up to the KV-1, which is only a 1,006 away. And guys, I wanted to thank you. We're um, so close to 200 subscribers, which is... Uh, more than enough to fill an entire movie theater with people sitting, standing, and like in partially in the hallway. So that's just amazing to know that there's like that many people just that like my videos and stuff. Um, sports has been great and it's been continuing, and it, there's just been more and more of it. So thanks for that, and thanks for bearing with me as I don't entirely follow the schedule. I'm also going to be trying out something called track and field, which I'm not overly excited about, but you gotta try new things in life, so. All I can say to that is, Leroy Jenkins. And if any of you who don't know what that means, I will never speak to you. No, just kidding. Oh, uh, Leroy Jenkins was um, actually a real person, believe it or not, and he was top gamer in over a thousand games but he had a style of just charging in and then still winning every game he only lost two games in his entire life and um he's actually in a retirement home at the moment which is quite cool but um yeah that's where the battle cry Leroy Jenkins comes from right there's the base I don't want capture the base with not with those nasties over here I am going to be sneaky Kyle you always know it doesn't turn out when you're being sneaky good point I'm not sure if this is the smartest thing to do. I have to set an enemy on fire. Oh, there's an enemy T28. Ah, here's the standard turret. I have 350 health, and he has 212 at the moment, actually. Why don't I cap? I don't know. Yeah, why? I don't. I never cap. Hmm. T thirty four tier five medium. 
Uh, that was artillery. Run away. A second th on that thought. Run away. You focus on him, and I'll kill you. There we go. He's dead. <sighs> nice hook. Took 70 damage off that. The next 40, I kill that with different. No. <sighs> On second thought, that's, that's KV220 over there. We're winning by two. And he's being he's spotted by artillery. I'm not sure if I am. So let's just pawn out of here. Who's a crusader? Tier five British light tank. Well, let's just pull out. Oh, there's an M4. No, 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 no. Run away from the M4. M4s are nasty. They've got a really big gun and lots of armor. They are very slow. Ooh, hold on. This is a good reload and a good and good damage. And good, oh, has good out for damage and good DPM, and a good rate of fire. Pop, Dang. didn't pop him in the butt. Oh, hello, you're an arty. Run away. Blowing ring around the rosy. Let's roll out. Goodbye. Duh. 57 health. Not happy about that. Ah, dang it. KV220. Got me. Um, yeah, so those were two of my favorite tanks. The T28. And the Panzer 3-4. 3-4. Um... You can either go up to the Panzer III, Panzer III A, and the Panzer II, or um, you can go through the VK twenty on the Panzer II G and stuff. Yeah, but that's how that works. So hope you guys have all enjoyed. Hope you all do decide to subscribe, and I'll see all of you later. Goodbye.